Well, we're going to have another start like we did yesterday. We're going to have a dense fog alert for most of us. It's looking to be mostly along 10, and we see that as, as you head further out west, seeing some of that fog. Right now, we're not seeing it too bad here in Baton Rouge, down to three miles. Gonzales actually down to one mile. We're seeing this pocket just between Gonzales and Homa. Thibodeau in there hitting about less than a mile. We're hitting a half a mile for Homa and Morgan City at a quarter. So there are some spots of some cloudy conditions in that fog, but taking a look at Baton Rouge, not too bad if you want to get out this morning and check out the moon. This is what it's going to be looking like. It's got that red hue to it. We're hitting the peak right now. It's going to be five to six, and it was when we're seeing it at full. So it's taking a nice look. Hitting 68. It's not too bad out there temperature wise. We're going to be, of course, watching it stay warm and humid through the rest of your day. 68 for most out there. Seeing some 69 and some low 70s, Homa and Morgan City at those 70s. We're going to gradually warm up as we go through the rest of the day. We're going to hit those upper 60s to start us out. Early 70s, 76 by 9 o'clock. Then we're seeing those 80s again coming back for us. We're going to hit 87 for our high temperatures. It's going to be warm. It's going to be humid. And we're going to watch to see because the record for today is 89. We're going to see we're going to be just below that cusp here in Baton Rouge. We see one or two that are going to be getting there. Denham Springs could be tying it, but right now a lot of us are staying below those record temperatures and we're going to see our temperatures gradually cool down. We're going to be seeing 63 as we go into tonight, so you can already see our overnight lows are cooling down. Our high temperatures are gradually cooling down as we hit low 80s for tomorrow, so it is going to get a little cooler throughout this week. Now, we hit our cold front that's going to be coming through as we go into the weekend. So we have a quiet week ahead of us. We're still watching, of course, tropical, uh, subtropical storm Nicole as they're ex expected to get to briefly a Category 1 right before it makes landfall on Florida's east coast and is going to be impacting them as it goes into Thursday. Us here, though, we're staying on the quiet side. Again, that light cool down of low 80s with clear skies overnight. We'll see some 50s return for our overnight lows. But then we go into Saturday and Sunday where we really see that cold front. We're going to add a little bit of some isolated showers going in on Saturday with this front that's coming through. We're going to hit high temperatures in the 60s and our overnight lows getting into the 30s. So it is going to be chilly coming up for the weekend and going to next week. So enjoy the nice warm couple of days we have this week. And of course, going into the next couple of days, 